Hello, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2, uh, the old gods as the Kingdom of Sweden. And, uh, welcome to the dawn of the Scandinavian Empire, or at least I'm going to definitely attempt to, uh, form it with Thorder, the Filker of the Norse people. Where he is now King of Norway and of Svitiod. This doesn't look like we're going to be losing anybody. Oh, shoot. Oh, a peasant revolt has been declared. Peasants have risen up in Cell. Led by a disgruntled former soldier, the rebels have the nerve to demand independence. Blasted traitors. Alright, we're just going to have to get some of our forces together. I am not going to take the time to send a proper force or to bring down my troops for one. That's just what I need. Discovered a plot where Ingerth Ingerther of Hydemark seeks to fabricate claim under the Yard of Oslinlet. End your plot, cheapness. Alright, let's take care of this little revolt that we have on our hands first. And then we will attack. We're losing some prime time here. What do you want? Oh no, yeah. No, we're going to reject diplomatically. You're not taking one of my titles. For any reason. Alright. Get our best men in charge. Now let's get rid of these rebels. Now we should have no problem fighting them. Ooh, Volta there is pregnant. Oh, they're going to be moving. We're going to bounce them back and forth, huh? All right, there. So they're going to go to Bremen. Let's move to end their miserable lives. And once more into the breach. Oh, it looks like we killed the uh, leader. Enforce our demands. And we'll send home our troops. At the same time, we'll declare war. Conquest. And we'll raise all of our forces. Oh, put our good men in back in charge. And uh, raise our forces in just a moment. Hopefully we can take this really quickly. So that uh, we don't have to worry about... Oh, man. Another kid. Finally, things are paying off. I do believe that one of the, the patches did reduce the birth rate, so... We should have enough, though. All right, I'm going to raise troops, territories that are not occupied by any enemy troops. And shouldn't have to worry about anything. Uh, Oldenburg has been uh, changed to the Norse faith. And we'll march our men across. 
You don't need that many to actually take the city. And I see you attacking his liege because we've got to uh, take that into consideration. Yeah, he's in an independence war right now. Oh, it looks like Perm took some land. We're going to have to fight them. I don't want to, but nothing we can do about it, really. It's part of our empire, sir. Ooh, older. Alright, let's just assault. Be done with it. Alright. Let's stop our forces so that we can disband them. Oh, Perm, why did you have to do that? Alright, so everyone should be out. Dismiss our levies. You know what I can do this time? Let's declare war on Estonia. And then we'll declare war on Livonia as well. That way we can just take both the territories at the same time. We should be able to uh, take those guys out, this little army. just by sheer numbers. Alright, yep. We've won, we've won, we've won. Oh. We're going to need a quite a few troops to take over this territory. They've actually upgraded their fortifications. Hmm. Okay, so this one's going to take a little bit longer. What about Livonia? Livonia, just 10,000. Oh my, Denmark. How did that happen? Hmm. So Denmark has changed hands, or...? Yeah. Alright, that's an obstacle. Oh well. Let's see... My daughter needs to be... Oh, she's gotten the attractive trait. Who's the best diplomat we have? Gunnar, teach my daughter well. Oh yeah, I'm going to take this one over immediately. Oh, we're going to have to take more than that. Alright, that's fine. Let's just move over to Livonia. We should be able to end that conflict very quickly. Oh, he's already surrendered. We accept. I'm actually going to give it to my son. Oh, wait. 
What about my other son? Uh, he's not gonna ha be of age for another year, so let's uh, give it to you. my son. Uh, we'll invade Livonia. In we'll invade Livonia. And we can assault and end it pretty quickly. Scrambling before my monarch dies. Alright, now. This territory I'll probably end up giving. Well, I can give it to my son, but I just have to find a good match for him and hope that she doesn't die. Ooh, he's not turning out too well. Oh my, England. Attacked again. Uh, we've got to catch up. Um, English crown. My granddaughter. I mean, she could... He would prefer a matrilineal marriage. Of course he would. Hmm, let's see. What else could we do? That's one more territory that I need that is taken up by someone else. Damn you, Sterla. Empire of Scandinavia, 77%. I might need two more, I think? Two more territories? That would have been one. But I do have a strong claim on the county of Schoon, so I may end up pressing that one against Denmark. So let's do this. Let's send our military home again. And we'll declare war for in carry. And I do believe I took over some territory. Okay. So we need to send a seer to Osterboten. to convert that territory. Oh, wow, I have another territory that I didn't conv convert. Well, okay. And... I have to do something with this one. Wow, all of your children died, my brother? Suspicious accident, a maimed cripple, and a maimed cripple. Wow, the line on this side of the family is not did not do too well. You're Alberto of Ex Essex. That's my kinsman. Alright, let's move... My army over here. Give over some of this land. Oh, look at this. Wonderful. So there's already a war. Uh, a faint whisper draws your attention, and you find a haggard old crone in a dark corner of your longhouse. Before you have a chance to throw her out, she explains that she is a vulva, a seeress. She claims to be powerful in the way of seder, seder, and has come to offer her services. I guess so be it. Oh, Anna. 
You are ugly. Mystic. And a scholarly theologian. 53. I don't think you're going to last long. Alright, so there is a war going on. Prince Fries, Fries claim on Denmark has been declared. I can actually take Schoon away from him pretty quickly. Now it looks like... Nuyanza of Inkeri is running. Are we going to catch him? 29th of August, 5th of September. Unfortunately, no. But what we can do... Local leaders, that'll be 769 troops. 96. Who's counting? 900. Well, we can raise some troops. Load them up, and then drop them off. Tudman of Sudamund has inherited a county. I see. Okay. Alright, so we've got our three men in charge of this army. Three best. Actually, I think since they're engaged, I can't move them, so we're good. Let's get you up north so we can counter that army. Send these boats home. Still, domain too big. Where are you going? 9th of December, 22nd of November. And we'll take a look at this. Hopefully, this war will go on for a little bit longer. Alright. Send them running. See what our friends in England are doing. Cutting a swath through uh, Northern Europe, or Northern France, I should say. I think there's only one territory here. Yep. So once it falls, we're good. Jarl of Carolyn, not really happy with me for raising his troops, but that's okay. I'll send him a nice gift. And Poland, you are Slavic, and Lithuania, you are still a Minusco. Ah, uh, yes. And Bavaria owns the rest of Saxony, which would be good. We can also take it without going to uh, without declaring a holy war. Wow, East Frank it has been excommunicated. There's a lot of stuff going on here. All right. Pakinalina has fallen. Oh, I am getting old. All right. So how far? How close? 
Are we there? Are we there? Okay. Maybe one, maybe two more. So the easiest thing to do is to declare for Schoon. It's not going to be easy. Even though I said it's going to be the easiest thing. Uh, let's see. My son. My son. I have a lot of sons. Um... What I would like to do is land them, but I'm going to need some marriages. He's 11. Oh, wow. I don't have a lot of uh, Jarls in my territory. I, I distrust them so. How about her? Arrange a patrol to Thorstein. Yes? Alright. We'll have him accept. Alright, son. Hopefully she survives. We've got a lot of sons, and you're not the most... the best looking one, so... Give you Ingria. Stay my I stay your guardian, which is good. Let's get your these boats. Pick up my retinue. And get ready to unleash them on Schoon. Let me just make sure that I still my ward. Good. Dyer's five years old and he's quick. Inga's eight years old. We'll arrange a patrol though. says yes. Uh, my son Thorstein is aiming for the stars. Oh, wonderful. Gain the ambitious trait. A lot of competition. We need competition. Alright, so I'm going to give my s other son some land. Trigva, I mean, you're not the best, but <sighs> you're what I have. <laughs> All right, let's go for Schoon. Let's see, what is this? Uh, it's going 2% uh, in favor of Chief Joseph Holston. Oh, Schoon, you are spread out. So we'll see if he decides to... Oh, wow. There's a big army in between all of us.
if he decides to get go uh, declare uh, peace with his lord or not. Oh, yes, yes, a little, little defeat. And you can kill a few of my men. But, you'll find... Oh! Look at this. Yardum of Schoon. I could have had it. Thank you. So we'll just let it go. Should I let it go? I hate this game sometimes. Mm-hmm. I'll let it go. I'm reasoning being uh, that I can take it as m at my leisure and not lose any money. More prestige. All right, what do we need? About ten thousand will not be a problem. We've got that now, or eleven thousand. Ripping through here. All right. Go north. Wait. Is this schoon? Yeah. We're all a schoon. Yes, 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 yes. All right. Good. Good. We accept your surrender. Now, do we have enough? No! You need to control 80%, you control 80%. Alright, hold on. That doesn't make any sense. Huh. <sighs> My god. Well, now I wish I had the... Yarldom. Okay. Send you home. Send you home. Send everybody home. Now yeah, we'll lose a few troops, that's fine. All right, what can we do? What can we do? On pause for one. Oh, oh, we're going to think about it. Uh, that would be enough for this episode. And hopefully next episode, we get what we need. All right. Um, if you like what you've seen, please subscribe. Uh, please like. And I'll be back with another episode soon.